Michael Otribefi, Chief Executive Officer of the Ghana Free Zones Authority, in a landslide victory, has taken the new job in South constituency candidacy from incumbent Member of Parliament, Mark Esibeyabwa, uh, on Saturday. Mr. Otribefi polled 372 votes out of the total number of 572 votes cast. I've been speaking with him about his victory. Who shouldn't have allowed me to contest? The party. Is it, is it a democratic party? Not everybody, not, not everybody got a contest. Yes, because then those people were the people that the, the party wanted to, the, uh, the party wanted in parliament. You understand? You understand the, what I'm talking about? Mm. All those people were protected. All those people that the party fought hard for them to go on the post were the people the party wanted in parliament. Very simple. You don't think he was wanted in parliament? No, but if you are so much needed in parliament, you would have been protected. Mm. Very simple. There are people who think that will leave a, a huge gap. Those people who say that are people who are not part of our, of our fraternity. Because you know that we can only protect an asset or somebody who is very important in the whole game. So if the person is not protected, what's the meaning? That the person is not important. Or not important is not important, but that the person, when the person exits, there, will, there wouldn't be any gap. Mm. That's the meaning. That's what, what I, I think, I, the, the way I understand the whole issue. Because then, why is it that people were parliamentarians, like Abraham Edu. He was the majority leader, the Tama West MP, former MP. He was contested by Natoshi. Natoshi was a young, very young lady then. She came in and contested a colossus like a, a stalwart. And when he, she defeated the man, a young man emerged to show me that she was to the party in parliament. That was Osechiman Sebonsu. But for the exit of Abrahamidu, we wouldn't have gotten Osechiman Sebonsu. So politics like that, nobody is indispensable. J.H. Benza was one of the best economists in the time of Buzia. Remember, he was a finance minister. He's not there now, but government is still running. So nobody is indispensable. We may get a new finance committee chairman who will be the best as far as the whole political system is concerned. So for me, we should not think like that. It, then it defeats a principle of politics or democracy. I mean, we have to all go into elections. The president himself was, he himself subjected himself to elections, or, and he contested elections. <laughs> when everybody knew that there was no way he was going to lose, people still contested him. Nobody told them to stop. So it's something that I don't believe at all. What is more, if the president himself has contested elections before, what makes it... Uh, difficult for a finance committee chairman to also contest elections.